now basically we are going to solve the problem number 3 on complex power calculations in a electrical circuit okay so here in the problem it is given that the voltages across two series connected circuit elements are v1 is equal to 100 sin omega t volt and v2 is equal to 50 sin omega t minus 30 volt if the circuit current is 4 plus j2 ampere find the complex power of circuit okay now what we know the complex power is basically represented by s is equal to p plus jq is equal to v i conjugate okay here all the bar quantities are basically failure quantities now as per the problem first what we have to do we have to draw a circuit diagram schematically representing the circuit conditions okay so this is our element 1 this is our element 2 it is given that voltage across element 1 is v1 equal to 100 sin omega t and v2 is equal to 50 sin omega t minus 30 this is basically 30 degree okay and current in the circuit is i basically it is the phase of quantity is equal to 4 plus j 2 ampere okay so you can take the input voltage to the circuit to be as v okay now this v1 is equal to 100 sin omega t can be represented in phasor form v1 is equal to 100 by root 2 at the angle of 0 degree similarly v2 bar equal to 50 by root 2 because all the phasor quantities always have their values in RMS okay at the angle of 30 degrees minus 30 degree okay so from the diagram it is clear that the input voltage is basically equal to v1 bar plus v2 bar that means the phasor sum of the voltages across two elements of the circuit will give you the input voltage to the circuit because you need that voltage for finding the complex power of the circuit okay so now this is equal to 100 by root 2 at the angle of 0 degree plus 50 by root 2 at the angle of minus 30 degree okay now this can be written as follows 100 by root 2 cos of 0 plus j sin 0 plus 50 by root 2 into cos of minus 30 degree plus j 
sin of minus 30 degree. Okay. So this is equal to 70.71 into 1 plus J0 plus 35.36 into 0 0.86 minus J 0.5 okay so finally what we will get we will get this is means V bar or the input voltage is equal to 101.11 minus J 17.68 volts this is basically the input voltage to the circuit now we already got i is equal to 4 plus j2 ampere so conjugate of i will be 4 minus j2 ampere thus we can write the complex power is is equal to V I conjugate that means this is equal to 101.11 minus J 17.68 into 4 minus J2 okay now after mathematical calculations from this we will get 369.08 minus j 272.94 okay now comparing this with P plus JQ, what do we get? Definitely, this is our answer for the complex power which we need to find out the complex power and comparing this with P plus JQ, we get P is equal to active power of the circuit is equal to 369.08 watts or approximately equal to 369 watts okay and q equal to reactive power of the circuit is equal to 272.94 bar or volt ampere reactivity which is approximately equal to 273 bar okay so these are basically our answers so i think now with the help of these equations you can find out complex power associated with any electrical circuit like this okay so thank you thanks for watching